to tell you a little bit about our non-negotiable sales standards. And uh, one of the ways that we enforce and help you to learn on how to do those is by sending in mystery shoppers. What's a mystery shopper, you ask? Well, it's people that we have, friends of ours, or people that we have uh, had that volunteer to come in and kind of just do a, a look around at our stores and check on you and make sure that everybody is doing uh, what is required of them. And so I'm gonna tell you a little bit about those. First of all, it's uh, one of the things is to make sure you have a complete and ironed uniform. That's one of the sales standards. Uh, and of course, your apron will be on, but you'll be wearing the proper uniform, which we've discussed. Um, and then also they'll check to make sure that the store is clean and smelling good and ready for business. And they'll be checking on how many people were on the sales floor and what were they doing. What were their activities? Were they professional? Were they talking on their phone? Were they texting? Were they looking at Facebook? Those are all bad things. Don't do those. That what you should be doing is making sure that when customers walk in the door, you actually provide them with our non-negotiable sales standards. So here they are. You must greet and approach every customer with a non-business related opening line. Nothing like, hi, can I help you today? We don't want a customer to feel like they should have to put a wall up or that they have to say, no, 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 I'm just looking or I'm just browsing or no, I don't need any help. You want to engage with these customers. Talk to them about how their day's going. Ask them what kind of dogs they have at home. Ask them how the weather is, if they have any weekend plans. Come up with about 15 different opening lines that you can rotate through on a regular basis in order to start a conversation with these, these people that are coming into our stores. So the goal is to open up an open line of communication with them so that then you can say well, our next thing, uh, which is our next non-negotiable selling standard, which is ask something very close to the phrase, would you do me a favor and socialize and exercise a puppy today? Our goal is to make sure that these puppies all get out on a regular basis every day. And it's your job to make sure that that happens. The only way that any puppy could be able to get as much socialization as they do here is by making sure that every customer that comes in, you try and take advantage of them and use them to exercise these puppies. Now, obviously, we don't want to force it on anyone, but most people that come in your door, they're here because they like puppies. So ask them to do you a favor and play with one today. They can pick out whoever they want. And that's a great way to get them into a room with a puppy, and then you can ask them, do you like this dog? What do you like about it? What don't you like about it? What kind of dogs have you had in the past? What might you be looking for? This is a chance for you to build a relationship with this customer. Take that time while they're exercising a puppy and figure out maybe this is a good dog for them, maybe it's not. It's your job to make the right match. So the next thing that we're gonna discuss in the non-negotiable standards is number three, which is present the pet to every customer by putting it in the customer's arms in a showroom. You and I both know that puppies are wiggly and they can fall and get very hurt if we're not careful. That's why we've created the showrooms. So it's a great place for people to get to know the puppies and for the puppies to get out some of their energy. So do your best to make sure that whenever you get a puppy out, that puppy goes into a showroom, is placed on the floor where it's gonna be safe, and you instruct the customers not to pick up the puppy and be careful not to drop the puppy. So obviously if there's children involved, you wanna make sure that they're staying seated on the floor and that they aren't walking around with the dog. It's your job to make sure that dog is safe, so make sure you always keep your eyes on them. Don't worry uh, about feeling like you're hovering. It is your job as the protector of that puppy to make sure that they're always in a, in a great position to be safe and healthy and be happy. Always make sure that the puppy is looking and smelling its best when you hand it to a customer. Uh, make sure that you check its eyes, its feet. Um, obviously they can step into things and we don't wanna hand those to customers where they'll get dirty. Make sure that you check its front, its back, and its feet and make sure that everything is clean before you give it to them. If not, take a minute, go back, brush it up, make sure that everything's been removed, spray it with a nice little bath mist and then offer it back to the customer. And then also, when you pull that puppy out, make sure you check its cage before you put it back to make sure that there's no messes in there that need to be cleaned up so that the puppy doesn't step in that mess after that. Um, the other thing that we're gonna talk about real quick in the non-negotiable selling standards are the two things that you should take over to every showroom after you pull a puppy out. And those are our storybook and your resource kit. These are very important tools that we give you to make sure that the customers know what makes us different. 
So it's your job to explain each of these. We've gone over them in a couple of other videos. If you haven't watched that yet, make sure that that's the next one you watch. It'll talk in depth about the fact uh, of what each page and, and the storybook itself and why it's important and also the resource kit and what's available in there and what you need to show the customers. Thanks for being a part of this. We're excited about having you here. We do have some non-negotiable standards like I just explained that will help you become a better pet counselor and hopefully help find lots of puppies great homes. So go to it. Thank you.